We are in Turfin. Now to find the king and demand a ring. Lovely. Away with thee. No, that's not actually who I want to speak to. Isn't that one? This looks like it's gonna be awkward. Ah, reagents. something, it's always best just to, well, nick it, and then hand it to the avatar. The avatar is hungry. He shall eat this meat. Wow, I have a lot of reagents. It's better that way. I'd rather have a lot of reagents and not know what to do with them too few and run out. <whistles> Definitely not stealing stuff. Ah, a nice gargoyle. Must be a gargoyle I've not stolen the food of yet. I must examine this hypothesis by trying to steal all his food. It would seem he doesn't have any. Oh, you could not use a drink. Quiet. God, this guy has no food either, except a of mutton that I shall steal. And a sextant and ooh blood moss. Nothing. Bucklers. Lots of boring stuff. Gunpowder. Because for some reason you need gunpowder. He lives near the hall. He lives near the altars. <coughs> Back to the altars, I guess. Not the bloody fellowship. Sorry, I have to spit every time I hear that. Ask him about the ring. Hmm. Ah, possessions. Ah, the ethereal ring. To be indeed a lovely treasure, to have been quite useful. A shame to have really had to have to had to sell it. To have been one of my favorites. To have sold most of my treasure when we were uh, asked, shall we say, to move to the island. To have all happened rather quickly, you see. To have sold most to the Sultan of Spectrum. 
to have seemed nice enough for a human, to be a bit mad he is, even for a human, to tell you he lives on an island just to the west of us. To know, at least, that my prized possession would be in safe in his hands. Oh, safe! No. He's a bit loopy, is the, uh... Is that man? He does live a bit west. And a bit north. He's also a bit insane. Let me ensure you, he's Quacko. Are you sure? Think again. Let's avoid the Isle of Meditation just for now. to head to 144 south. tiny island, we've got to get the ethereal ring. And with this ring, we can summon the power of ethereal! It, it really does work with the power of heart. Ethereal makes you turn invisible and live on the ethereal realm. You may not think it's useful, but trust me, if you're a spy, entering the ethereal realm would kick ass. You'd be like, oh, well, I'm invisible now. I'm going to uh, hide in this wall. This must be where he lives. Notice all the topiary guardian, topiary animals. Uh. Hello! You see a nobleman all alone with a demented gleam in his eye. Who in the blazes art thou? His attitude is that of someone who's just interrupted from something terribly important. I am the Avatar. Of course thou art! And I am the evil spirit of Mundane, come back to wreak havoc on Britannia. Funny, thou dost not look like an Avatar. Thou dost look like a fool. What can I do for thee, Mr. Fool? Oh, really? Thou dost think this Avatar looks like the real thing? I doubt it, Lucinda. I doubt it very much! He's looking to someone who's not there. He turns back to you and grins. The Ethereal Ring. Martigo looks suspicious. Art thou wanting to steal my Ethereal Ring? turns to his imaginary friend and whispers, No, I'm right. Our guest looks like a thief. Turns back to you and smiles. Yes, I do have an ethereal ring. I purchased it from the king of the gargoyles. What was his name? He leans towards the visible plant and like, Rot? Oh yes, Draxodium. I knew it all the time. It is in my vault. Marty goes out of My vault is the most protected vault in all of Britannia. No one, and I repeat, no one can steal anything from my vault. I have many fine treasures there. Those new sender of bites of non-existent yellow. Uh, security is my secret. You've reached our entrance. In fact, I dare thee. That's good to succeed. You're welcome to take anything. All I just need is the key. And I'm sure that we'll find it. Uh, okay. Not there. Oh. <laughs> ah! Stone Harpy! Stone Harpy's a tough. ability to teleport people everywhere. Ah. We'll leave it there.
there, folks, because this stone harpy's glitched out, it would seem, or at the very least, he's kicked our ass. When we come back, folks, we'll kick that stone harpy in the butt.